Okay, let's see if this guy can actually do any work on my weapons uh, without me bringing in tools on this new AK I've picked up. Alright. Oh, we can make an underbarrel mount for it, but he needs tools for anything else. Okay, well, let's go get that grenade launcher then. I think this two round burst does mean we're going to go through arrow a lot quicker. Uh, detach grenade launcher, and attach it to my AK. Are we still carrying my grenade? I am, okay. You know what? I'm gonna go put that back. I don't actually want to carry the grenade launcher. I'll leave that there. Because the thing is, I hardly ever use grenades. So what's the point in carrying the extra weight, right? Uh... Are these things friendly? That would be a no. Why are these guys so chill about these dogs? Alright, well. That was awkward. I'm gonna go out this door instead. Oh, that's much nicer. Yeah, you know what? I take that back. And it's vanished. I have no interest in chasing that thing down. Usually I would have beeline straight forward and put holes in its head, but... Not this time. Okay, so I've got an automatic, a one-tap, and a two-tap mode. Let's run with the two-tap, see how that goes. There is a guy up here, though. This counts as a safe zone? Okay. I can't get in there. Oh, here we go. Let's see what's up here. Maybe we'll have a quest or something. Is this like a, a sniper tower? Obviously I'm glad to see you, but I wouldn't mind being on my own for a while either. Uh, okay. Well, that's a duty guy. I'll take all that vodka. Damn, that was a lot of vodka. There's a light machine gun there. Is that like an RPK, maybe? I don't know if they're even available to use in the game. I assume so, if they've made the model for it. But I've yet to encounter one. Is that another bloodsucker over there? Either that, or it's a new type of mutant I haven't found yet. Okay, so that's the second type of mutant I've seen. It's hostile. Oh, it doesn't actually two-tap unless I hold the button down. I see. So it's not like an instantaneous thing. You know what? I kind of like that. It'll help me conserve ammo if I don't spray, and if I'm just regularly tapping, it's no different. Just some toilets there. No stashes. You know what? I'm upset. I'm really upset. I'm astoundingly upset. I'm... I, I don't fucking know what that was. I was about to say I can only assume that's actually going to move because it seems a lot more detailed than the objects around it. But it was me that moved. Well, I can only assume there's like a stash down there or something. Uh, there, that's the button they're on. Well, that didn't do anything. I can't interact with it yet either. Probably for a quest then. Otherwise there wouldn't really be much point in marking this location because there's nothing else here. 
So the anomaly is just in that area right in front of me there. It's also very close to where the blood suckers are. Is that it right there? Yep, looks like it. That's a toxic anomaly. I've got chemical protection there. There's a blood sucker coming for us. Where is it? I'm looking for footsteps in the water. I saw something move. I think it's over there. There's two right in front of me. I heard movement over there, and a roar coming from over that direction. Well, they know I'm here, but they're not coming for me. Apart from... Right there, there's footsteps. Yeah, you can see it. Like the little splashes in the water. I need to get a bit further out in the open, trying to get it to come for me. Okay, that's better. Hmm. The other one's run off. Two of them dealt with. I think we're going to be safe to investigate this anomaly now. So let's get my toxic protection back on. Oh, there's an artifact right here as well. There it is. Get out of there. Put our healing back on while we inspect this artifact. Oh, it's just another stone blood. Okay. I'll just hang around a second, let my health regen a bit. Well, that one kind of clipped to me weirdly, jostled me about a bit. Oh well, they're dealt with. And I'm not dead. So let's have a look in this factory now. And while I'm out here, I might actually... Oh no, I'm in a completely different area. I was going to say I could inspect this bit here and see if I can get between the uh, two zones, but it looks like it's blocked off. There's people in here. Neutrals. I can get up this tower, though. And my objective is above me. Ooh. Okay. I see. There's an artifact up here. Oh, 
that's below me. Okay. Or above me. Well, that's a stash. There was a helmet in there. It looked like a freedom one. I think the artifact is still below me. So that was some wire? Wait, what was that? Okay, we got some kind of circuit board. Or well, we didn't. Uh, okay. Whatever it was I grabbed, it's not in my inventory. Oh no, there it is. Box of transistors. Okay. Okay, I'm putting my health regen back on. So the only way to progress now is to go down? That seems like such a new player trap right there. Let's heal up. Stick our fireball on. Alright, that was the artifact. Some more beads. What else is in here? Okay, so we can continue going down when previously we weren't allowed to. I do, of course, want to check all the rooms, though. Circuit boards. Not sure what that was, a plate of something? Oh, okay. So it's just like a... A soldering metal. Alloy, that's the word I was looking for. Okay, we can't go any further down that way. So another pack of transistors. What have we got here? Some more wire. Rusty spanner. A ladder down. Some more circuit boards. Some more of the materials. So I think that's everything then, by the sounds of it. Yep, we've got to go a bit further down. And there's a drop here. So you had no choice but to go up to the top first. Okay, that didn't go too bad. Whoever it was that was stood out here has moved on though. Oh, hello. I'll be honest, I actually jumped quite badly there. I thought it killed you. Ah, oh, there's another one. safe down here? I think so, it says waiting cover, not find cover. Well, I suppose I might as well explore this place I'm tracked down here for now. There's some stairs up there. Alright, let's not be out in that area. Alright, there's not really anything down here. Just a door I can't access and I imagine will never be accessible due to the rubble in front of it. Same with that door. No, 
All right, guess I'm just waiting. Ooh. It's a stash there. Is this the same place I was just in? Yeah. So I've got some med kits there. Was it those batteries I just picked up? Hmm, okay. So that steel helmet gives me a lot of psi protection. But this helmet here has a lot more- oh, it actually has more psi protection. It has more of everything. I guess I'll equip that then. It's just, in all aspects, better than this one. I hope this cover's good enough. The number of people around me is increasing. Are people trying to run to find cover here? Oh yeah, they're fighting out there, they're killing each other. Wow, the sky... Fuck. The sky does not look happy. Oh hey, at least there'll be some loot out that way once we get out of this, uh, this hole. Some more fighting there. Two people just the died. Is over. I hope everyone's okay. If you're hurt, come to Yanov and we'll patch you up. This guy's hostile. What was that all about? Oh, the zombies. Was that because they were outside during the emission, maybe? So is that where all of the ones from that other town came from? Hmm, that would make sense. So they killed these guys, and then the anomaly zombified them. Well, they had a bit of ammo for me, so that's good. The weapons are actually in decent condition as well, so we can sell them on. Uh, not that pistol, though. We can, we can drop that. And this one, too. Okay, this is above... Yeah, those are the stairs I saw in that underground tunnel. This building sounds... Well, seems to be radioactive, too. Now that looks like a stash location to me. If I climb all the way up here and there's nothing, I'm gonna be really upset. I'm not going to jump off of this one, though, because, uh, you know, I kind of lose a lot of progress. And even if I saved up top, I'd have to walk back down anyway. Okay, there's a dead guy there. He was a zombie. Oh, these must have been the people that I saw here in the first place. Yeah, these were freedom. So, uh, no stash? Oh, I could go higher. Yeah, no stash. So what's this rifle? SGI 5K it uses the standard 556 by 45 Weapons of this series are one of the best in their class, renowned for their reliability, accuracy, and ease of use. Hmm, okay. So that sounds like a decent replacement for my NATO weapon. Which I've left in... Skadovsk. Oh, there's a couple of people alive down there. Yeah, three of them. Oh, six now, apparently. I'm carrying quite a lot of equipment, so I probably want to see if some of them will, you know, buy some of this stuff from me. Hey, bro. Speak to the boss. Uh, trade. He'll buy two of these pistols, but that's it. Okay, that's fine by me. I'm listening. So I think it's time to head back to Yanov, end in these quests, put my stuff in my box. We've got a stash down there. 
All right. 